All right, we've all had that client that needs like a hundred different versions of that awesome product video that you made and they need it right away. They've got like a hundred different t-shirt designs that they want to showcase and you're left with figuring out a workflow to produce all of these on time and on budget. The solution involves using After Effects together with image tracking and automation. So Chris is going to show us Lockdown, which is an image tracking software for AE, and I'm going to show you Templator, which is an automation extension for AE. In this toolkit, we have four shots, and we can change the logo on each of them to whatever we want. We can also change the shirt color and the background color. To track the shot, go to Effect, Vranos, Lockdown, then press Pop Out. Track the points roughly where the logo is going to be placed, then create some expansion points, and enable interpolation so they follow the existing points. After you close Lockdown, press the Lockdown button in the After Effects interface, and it will create a stabilized pre-comp inside here. Add your logo. Back in the main composition, your logo will track to the shirt. There are a lot of fine points to tracking, but these basic steps will get you most of the way. To reversion the shirt logo, select its layer and apply the Templator Settings effect. Then, point Templator to the folder containing all the logo files. Next, connect Templator to a new Google Sheet. Copy and paste the logo files into a new column. They'll appear as file names. Name another column to match the name of the logo layer. In that column, stitch a subfolder path to the file names. This column is now mapped to the logo layer inside your comp. Back in Templator, preview how each logo looks with Lockdown's tracking directly in the comp viewer. Adjust the Templator settings scale factor to force all the logos to fit a specific area. You can also map data to text layers and use that data to control color via expressions. To automate output, choose a module and render settings from the Templator panel. Then click Render. Wait for Templator to complete its automation tasks and enjoy the saved time.